First thing this morning, I'm putting roast into the crock pot. I'm gonna add some onion, potatoes, probably this whole bag of carrots. We'll see if they fit. <laughs> and then I have some bouillon cubes, about three cups of water, and this Snyder's prime rib and roast seasoning. I already put the roast in the crock pot and I sprinkled some of the seasoning over the top of that as well. It is a very full crock pot. <laughs> But this is going to be such a delicious meal. So everything is in. I'm going to set this on low and let it cook for the day. I have a loaf of frozen bread. I just buy it at Walmart in the freezer section. You can get five loaves of dough. So I'm letting that thaw out to go with our roast meal tonight. And then for breakfast, I'm just keeping it quick and simple. And I have some of these hash brown shredded potatoes from Walmart. I seasoned them. And I'm gonna have a half of a cup of egg beaters. I wanna get my water started for the day, so I'm gonna use this cup because I'm heading out in a little bit. I figure I can switch cups when I get home. I'll use my bigger one. Better turn my burner down. I think it's cooking too fast. <laughs> I do that, I forget that I have my burner set higher to start it out to get the pan warmed up. And then I start cooking, it cooks fast. I'm like, oh crap, I gotta turn that down. <laughs> that looks like a pretty good breakfast for this morning. So I'm gonna take this in and I'm gonna take it with me and eat while I get ready this morning. I am off to get a pedicure really quickly. Okay, I got a really pretty pink, hot pink on my toes <laughs> so that'll make me happy it's a good spring color it's probably more summery but i'm ready for summer so i'm good it's pouring here after i um got my pedicure i came out to target and ran into target really quickly i am still searching for the bumpy jelly beans i call them which are the nerds chewy jelly beans but not the gummy ones i found some candy recently on amazon when I was walking through Target, I spotted it. Yeah, I was so excited. <gasps> and then at the back of the store, I found this, the mother load of all of this candy. Oh man, the decisions I have to make. What kind am I gonna get? There's so many to choose from. Ooh, look at these pillows. Ooh, if I had somewhere to put these, I'd buy one or two. Oh look, that's bright yellow and it says happy. That's just cheery. Oh, I love all these little bunnies. They have chalk. Lots and lots of Easter baskets. Wow, blue and pink. Oh, cute. Oh, look at like ballerina baskets. A wreath, that wreath is cute. Oh, a little bunny house with some plates. Oop, there's some empty shelves. I like that wreath, the egg wreath. Hello, spring. <laughs> no way, I found it. Score. Oh my goodness, that's a carrot whisk. What? And an egg spatula. Oh goodness, I really, really, really like those bowls. Oh, I want some of those. But they had some really cute Easter stuff in there. I kind of looked around just a little bit, but I knew that it was going to start storming, so I was trying to hurry up and beat the rain. And I did not beat the rain. <laughs> I came out and it is pouring, it's thundering. <sighs> oh, but I'm not complaining because I have been wanting weather like this, so I'm perfectly fine. I'm going to head home and I will show you the stuff that I got at Target. I just got home and my bread looks like it's ready to go in the oven. That was perfect timing because I usually have it on the warmer, but I thought, you know what, I better take it off the warmer before I go or it's gonna be coming out of that pan. <laughs> I was right. So my oven is heating and I will show you really quickly what I got at Target. That rainstorm was horrible. Oh my goodness, it actually gave me anxiety. The car was hitting the, um, it was coming down so hard it was almost like flooding in areas. So it was pulling the car and semis were coming and splashing and you know, 
crazy, crazy. So, all right, let me show you what I got at Target. I had ordered some of these on Amazon. They're really low in sugar and in calories, but they didn't have the licorice style ones, but they're made with, I believe it's like real fruit juice and all that. They're, it's, they're good for candy, especially if you want something chewy or if you want, you know, something to watch a movie with, something like that. They have a huge selection at Target. Lots of different things to choose from. They have some that are like Sour Patch Kids. They have like the little, I think they're like the peach round chewies. They had some that look like the um, gummy worms even. So yeah, lots to choose from at Target. I was surprised. Okay, so I got those and yay, I found the nerds. So we're set on those. I gotta get my candy dish out and put those in my candy dish. I spotted these. I like to get seasonal Oreos. I don't know why, I just do. And then these are for Cooper for Easter. Well, I burnt one side of my sandwich. <laughs> so I'm just gonna have an open face sandwich. <laughs> I have turkey and Velveeta. One side is toasted, and I have some baked potato chips, whoops, and some sweet peppers and cucumbers. I am starving, so I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna sit down, take my water, and just relax for a little bit and eat my lunch. It is actually a late lunch because it's 20 after two already, oh my goodness. getting dark again we quickly the sun came out for just a little bit so we quick ran down to the mailbox grabbed the mail and came back so we dodged that but it looks like it's getting ready to rain again I have the front door the screen door a little bit open a little bit and the back screen so I'm getting breeze blowing through the front and back of the house oh I just love it I love hearing the outside and hearing the hearing the birds chirping outside and that means that my roast is done <laughs> so it's gonna sit on warm for a little bit I got my iced coffee because I need some energy <laughs> because what I really want to do is lay down and take a nap but I have these dishes to get done so and I also have dishes to unload out of the dishwasher so I'm gonna quickly do that Jason's having a potluck at work and he got this little meat grinder out for the kitchen aid last night and he ended up making a homemade ground bologna. He's gonna take that for everybody to enjoy ground bologna sandwiches. But he was pricing out the bologna. I mean, whoa, whoa. I told him I'm like, wow, man, back in the day, we used to buy bologna because it was a inexpensive way to feed, especially us as, you know, when we were children, it was an inexpensive way to feed children, peanut butter and jelly or bologna, you know? <laughs> it's not that way anymore. It's expensive. I told him like, they better enjoy it. <laughs> wow. But um, yeah, so that was a that was a shock to both of us. He was like, "Wow, I'm like, it'd have been cheaper just to put a casserole together, I think." But he just wanted to take ground bologna and let them taste it and see what they think about it. <laughs> okay, I got the dishwasher started, but I still need to hand wash the dishes really quickly. But the dryer stopped, so I thought I better get in here and get these folded so they don't wrinkle too bad. But I keep watching for Cooper out the back door because apparently the neighbor puppies around us are visiting with him. <laughs> so he's out there visiting a lot today with his friends. <laughs> but um, do you have any plans for Easter? Let me know in the comments below. We are sticking around the house like we always do but we have a ham that we had bought at Christmas time in the freezer. So we are going to have a ham. And then every year, if you have been following me for a while, you already know this, but if you're newer to my channel, I color deviled eggs, my deviled eggs, in just the normal egg coloring. And it makes for a beautiful Easter table with colored deviled eggs. It's something that my mom did my whole childhood every Easter 
and it is something I have done for the boys every single year. But honestly, I still color those eggs because it just makes the Easter table look extra special. Just that little something, you know? I got these pants, they're linen pants. I got the full size pant and the crop pant I'm wearing today at Walmart through that time and true. Man, I love that brand. They're getting really good clothes out right now. And most things are like $20 and under. I think the pants were 21, almost 22. And then the crop pants, I think were 16, 17, something like that. If they still have them, I will have them linked below. They are really cute and they are so comfortable. Have you noticed the gloves, the pink gloves? for me to put on while I'm doing dishes. Yeah, I completely forgot to put those on. <laughs> I'm trying to remember to do that, whether I have my nails done or not, because right now, for whatever reason, my hands are drying out and around my thumb, nails are cracking and splitting. So I want to make sure that I wear those gloves, which are doing me no good as they are sitting on the counter. Oh my goodness, I forgot to fill up my large water bottle and start drinking out of it when I got home. Oh, that's okay. Both of them are dirty, so I'm going to wash both of them now and then I'll have them to use for the next couple of days. It was so nice yesterday. We had the windows open in our home. The wind picked up really heavy yesterday and dust was flying. Last night, we had turned the lamps on and there was a layer of dust all over the tables and mind you the day before that it was dusted so there sh there was no dust on it i really should go through and like give the house a quick dusting i don't think i'm going to get to it today i'm just going to have to wait and do it tomorrow oh it just started hailing yeah what do you think of that it's crazy huh oh do you see the hail Oh my, wow, <laughs> that is coming down like crazy. I'm gonna make sure it's not coming in the back door too because, wow, oh my gosh, look at this. Look at it coming off that neighbor's roof. Oh my goodness. Ah, spring, I'm gonna close this one too. Whew. The floor got wet, Cooper, you do not want out there right now, no way. <laughs> Storm is making him nervous. At first, Tim's door was um, making some noise because his window was open, so it kept like um, clunking it, you know, shut, um, sucking it in from the air. <sighs> but he doesn't like the thunder. He's not crazy about the lightning. He's not crazy about, it's okay, baby, it's okay. He's scared. I might have to sit down with him for a little bit and get him to calm down. Oh, but he was really worried about Timmy's room. He had to go in and check on Tim, make sure he was okay. And now he's just, he's not okay. It's okay, he just cried. Oh my goodness, baby. Ha, ah, spring. <laughs> You're all right, Cooper. Oh. Whoop, chair down. <laughs> I figured that was gonna happen. These two chairs usually do tip when the wind gets really bad. So we might end up losing that one too, I don't know. It's crazy, it's still coming down. I just sat with him on the chairs and just loved and loved and loved. And he's just loving and loving. Oh, he's okay, it's okay. Or baby, we haven't had a storm like this since we've since we've had him, and he's not okay with it. Oh, this will be a fun spring because <laughs> these are the kind of storms we get out here in this part of Texas. We don't get like little, you know, nice little rains very often. If we get rain, it's like boom, I'm here. You get hail, <laughs> you get winds. <laughs> yeah, not like tink tink tink. I'm here. <laughs> my home smell like apple cider today what I should do is get a springtime scent although this apple cider smells so good and I thoroughly enjoy the scent of this throughout my home update on Jason so do you notice anything different no more oxygen <laughs> Took the machine back yep machine is back yes and I'm back to work. Yes, and he has his um, in-home health care. He doesn't have them anymore. And he got a clean bill of health from the doctor. Everything's good. 
and he said Jay could go back to work. So Jason, the day that Jason was going back to work, his boss got a hold of him, was it the day before? Yeah. And told him, oh hey, we've been at home working this whole entire time, but the day that he was going back, he's like, yeah, he, everybody's back in office. Which isn't bad, because I get to work three days from the office and two days from home every week. That's our new schedule, so that's yeah. not too bad. No, but it was, it was like, oh no, yeah, we were like, in a scramble. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Getting stuff around for lunch and yeah. finding all my equipment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yep. So, yep, he's back. He's normal again. Kind <laughs> of. Yeah. Love you. Mm, I love you. <laughs> okay. We are going to. <laughs> Your hands are cold. I know. It's cold it's outside. Cold outside. It is. It's it. This morning, it was like in the 70s, and it's, what did you say it was? It's 30? now 37, with a blizzard coming through. Yes. Just got an alert from the police. So it might be working from home tomorrow. Yes. <laughs> and Justin, too. Everybody might be here. Yeah. That'll be good. All right. We're going to go ahead and get the roast meal out. We're going to eat, and we have been thoroughly enjoying um, the office again lately. Oh man, that show is so stupid. It, Justin bought the whole series, so me and him and Jason are all just watching The Office. So thank you so much for joining me today and hanging out. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you soon. Bye.